Okay, one last thing we have to think about before we fill this whole tile in is the composition rules. So remember, those rules are transparency, overlapping without transparency called opaque overlapping, and size variation, and the rule of thirds. So I'm not that worried about the rule of thirds because my focal point's probably gonna be all over the place, not just in one place. So first of all, uh, transparency. I need to create two shapes that overlap and where they overlap, a change happens. Now I can use something that I already have in place or I can have some new shapes happening. So maybe I'll just do some kind of an organic shape. And where it overlaps this kind of wave shape, I'll have a change happening there. Um, another overlapping shape I need to come, in, come up with. It's also helping me break up my space. So another shape, I might just do it this way. So I have these two shapes overlapping. Size variation, <clears throat> I could use a shape and do some repetition with the shape. Um, I could say that these are all sort of triangles, so I could break them up a little bit, causing a little bit of a variation. Here, it's kind of asymmetrical. And the rule of thirds, like I said, not unless I make this shape the most dynamic thing in my whole composition, I think the rule of thirds is gonna take care of itself. <clears throat> but just to be on the safe side, I'll do some kind of really um, eye-catching kind of design. Spirals somehow always are very eye-catching. So I'll throw that in there just to make sure that my focus point is not right in the middle. I'm going to add Sharpie and colored pencil to this, and I will show you pictures of that when I'm done.